All right, it's basketball season. I'm a basketball fan, so I'm excited about this. And right now, a local nonprofit is hoping to get the community together for not just basketball, but music, food, art, and mentorship all of this to help youth in our area. Joining me this morning is Billy Weathers. He established the Be Well Foundation. I understand you guys have a big event this morning, but first of all, thank you for joining us this morning. Yeah, no problem at all, brother. All right, so Thanks I know you guys have an event this weekend. You guys are very excited about this. Can you talk about what's gonna be happening here and what this event is all about? Yeah, absolutely. So we put on long shots. Uh, it's a three on three basketball tournament to essentially give the uh, the five public high schools here in town a chance to compete against one another. You know, it's friendly competition, but, you know, I think uh, everybody enjoys a little bragging rights. Uh, we'll also have um, Supply Hive will be there helping us with um, interactive, you know, kids uh, pumpkin painting, uh, we'll have face painting there, we'll have food. Um, and just other interactive activities for not only, you know, the kids that are going to be participating in the tournament, but also the families. So, And Billy, this, this event sounds like it really brings together the community and it's going, uh, it's happening for a good cause. How did all of this come to be? Honestly, it happened last year when uh, the, you know, the public schools weren't allowed to participate in their sports or do practices or games. Um, you know, I came together with uh, just uh, some good friends of mine, uh, along with Julian Say and Taylor Rogers and Caitlin Sessman, a bunch of people that are, uh, you know, just help with the foundation and just wanted to essentially, you know, get, give kids a, ch a chance to participate and, and compete always. So, Yeah, man, I know you guys are doing a lot of good work here with youth and with kids. Why do you think it's so important for adults to get involved with kids and to provide mentorship and show them good examples? I think the most important aspect is setting an example. You know, my mother always told me if I'm going to, you know, try to be something in the world, I have to be a living embodiment of it. So um, I'm not going to tell anybody to do anything that I haven't done. Uh, so just, you know, I understand the importance of showing face and showing up in your community uh, time and time again. So just want to make sure that the kids see us, they're represented, and that they know somebody cares for them. And Billy, of course, the work that you guys do is beyond what's happening this weekend. What sorts of services or uh, other things do you guys do to help with kids throughout the year? Absolutely. We've got a, um, I'd say our, probably our most notable and just uh, most used is uh, Knowledge is Power, which is essentially a savings account for the, uh, for the Des Moines, you know, inner city schools. Um, we have Operation Wish List uh, that takes care of uh, families during the, the winter months um, and just a bunch of just in different uh, initiatives that try to get us into the schools and make sure that we're showing face and essentially providing resources to underrepresented kids, uh, sides of town, communities, and, you know, just teachers. Uh, we know it's hard for uh, teachers to, you know, fund some of these projects and ideas that they have and taking out of their own budget isn't always uh, suffice. So we just want to make sure that people know that we exist and that we're here to help. Yeah, and I love what you said there, you know, really showing some love to our teachers here in our area. Uh, if people want to get involved with what you guys are doing, how can they help? Uh, if you go to bewellfoundation.org, uh, we have our volunteer sign up. We have a bunch of tabs on there that kind of inform you as to what we do on a day to day basis, but also kind of like our monthly schedule. Um, if you have any interest in signing up, you can or you're emailing us, uh, you know, we try to get back to people as soon as possible. So if there's any questions, uh, if you can feel free to reach out to us. Um, but yeah, we, we enjoy all of the help, all of the questions, anything that we can help to provide. So. All right, Billy. Well, thank you so much. Uh, we wish you guys the best with everything this weekend. Know that we are cheering you guys on this weekend from Local 5. Thank you.